You might think that the answer to the question, how did the Plymouth colony get its name, is simple. The Pilgrim Fathers left England from Plymouth and decided to name their new settlement after the town they had departed from. But this isn't true. In fact, the Pilgrims didn't name the Plymouth area at all. Instead, the area was first extensively mapped out by the explorer John Smith, who had previously helped to found the Jamestown colony. Smith took care to preserve the Indian names for places, but named the entire region New England, replacing the Indian-derived name for the region, Norumbega. But on his return to England, Smith presented his map to the heir to the British throne and future king Charles I, and suggested that he should rename the settlements in the area. And so it was Charles who really named the area Plymouth. The Pilgrims chose to keep this name out of nostalgia for the home they had left. On another note, Plymouth Rock, long thought of as the place where the Pilgrims first stepped foot on land in Plymouth, is not mentioned at all by the Pilgrims themselves, and was only written as such 100 years later. 